All right, let's see. Do I just get in? Yeah, this one. Okay. SMP detected. Removal of blueprints and substance from the substance mobile printer required to comply with the Bradwellian Conversancy protocol. Please interact with the Bradwell Substance and Blueprint Reclamation System before access to water and energy research can be granted. Ah, yes. Substance shortage. That's a thing, actually. Spoils all the fun. All right, I guess I guess uh, I have to give up my... Access to water and energy research granted. Okay, so I'll see you in water and energy research. Yeah, I see on the bottom left corner now everything says zero. Zero units and zero blueprints. That's just the game's way of resetting your... Uh... So, Welcome to so you Clean don't Water cheat, and I guess. Energy Research, Dr. Sega. Thank you. You've been assigned an office and a shared lab space. Warning. Electrical shortages detected. Lifts have been taken offline for health and safety. Yeah, I noticed. Stupid elevator. Ugh. The freaking doors won't open. Ugh. You go ahead. See if you can find Dr. Chowdhury's office. Ugh. All right. Ooh, what's that? ID card. Can I get it? No, it's nothing inside. Okay. Also, these... Uh... Seriously, the camera sensitivity keeps uh, reverting back to its original presets. A bit annoying. Alright, keep on going. We're at clean clean water something something. I kind of just immediately forgot where I was at. Uh, we have to go see Mira Chandri's office. Okay. Fine by me. Have you logged off? Take care of... And take care for a safer workplace. These... Stupid elevator doors are annoying. Ugh. Like pimples that don't pop. Hey, I. Uh, I, I think. Uh, oh, come on, doors. Uh, yes, I'm out. Finally. Phew. Okay, I'm gonna scout for a way to medical, and you. Say hello to Dr. Chowdhury. <laughs> Imagine, that'd be very awkward. Uh, why would that be awkward? Wait, what's this? Photosynthesis in algae. Killer book. Ooh, a surfboard. Let's start to collect as much of these as we can. We didn't get a blueprint, so we can't really use it for anything. But it's good as substance, I guess. Uh, let's see, where's... Uh, this doctor's office. Uh, labs and maintenance. Obviously, this way is closed. Yeah. You have insufficient permissions to access the laboratories. Please see Dr. Chowdhury to complete orientation. Have you seen her office yet? It shouldn't be hard to find. No, I'm gonna just go here and investigate, investigate the office section number five. See here. Oh. Didn't really say. Just have to find it, I guess. Chandra, Chandra. Oh, here we go. That was easy. Please wait here until Dr. Chowdhury has returned to complete your induction. Yeah. If I were you, I'd have a snoop and see if you can find her guide. Our contracts are pretty clear about not removing Bradwell tech from the building. I'm clearly not a model employee. All right, let's find our guide then, shall we? This must be it. Maybe. Uh, I can't really tell, it's a bit out of focus, these letters, but it says, Dear Mira, I hope this letter finds you well. I realize I haven't heard from you since you look your, you look your new job at uh, R&D London. Also, no email? I understand swearing of social media, but email? Anyways, I'm writing in regard to a favor. Uh, redacted, they have been singing and dancing about their new water and energy systems, but trying to contact my connection with them seems to be drawing up dead ends. The closest I've got to an answer about it was something to do with something redacted being priority. Maybe if you can ask around Some and see what the carpet. planet are for Maybe the... I should shuffle my feet and static shock the system back to life. Redacted. Wishing you all the best and hope to hear from you soon. Kindest regards, uh, Rashmi? Okay. Insufficient permission, okay. Uh, let's see what else is there. Lamp. Alright. Uh, okay. Our tablets. What's this here? Ooh. 
Dear Mira, how the past three years have flown by. While I'm sad to see you leave, I'm sure you have certainly you are certainly off to help more people than you ever could with just us. Having worked with Bradwell Foundation in the past, I'm sure you'll uh, you'll make great things great things at Bradwell R and D. Okay. Maybe we'll be using some of your designs in the future. As thanks we commissioned Arges, Arges brother hmm. to create this lab for you, this table for, the for you. power cells from our guides. Attempting to remove a guide's power cell will result in an immediate and potentially harmful discharge of electricity. I know. I'll put the hammer down then. Stop talking, guys, please. I'm trying to read. I know how you love a puzzle box, so this is one just for you. The he even cost a. He even cast a combination reminder which can double as a nice ornament. Take care, Mira, and thank you. I wish for your... Uh, I, I wish for your nothing but... I wish for you nothing but happiness and success. Alright. So I guess this is the guides. Hmm. So Mira used to work with charities. Oh That's no, maybe cool. not. Okay. I've never done anything that helps other people in a basic humanitarian sort of way. I want to change that though. I I've certainly never had someone make me a bespoke bit of furniture because of the work I've done. Uh, where shall I place this? We need more, I think. We need to complete this set. Just... To make uh, exactly the same picture as we got there. We need more pieces, at least. Yeah. Okay, uh, where am I gonna find these pieces? What's this? The environmental science of safe water, okay. Really doesn't help me. Okay, let's look outside their office, maybe? Doesn't seem like, like I can reclaim anything else from here right now, so let me just have a look around. Uh, meeting room. There. Ooh! Reclaim the whole thing. Nice. Uh, was clean and water energy expansion territories. Phase 2, time frame speeds up chances, substance shortage, shortage situation, photo bioreactor, bio uh, full power test preparations. Nothing really else in this area here. Uh, no, let's check upstairs, shall we? Hey, I found a bunch of freight elevators in the maintenance section. Hang on. There. The bad news is, they aren't powered up, so we can't use them just yet. I'll look into it. In the meantime, you need to find a way to get to maintenance. Okay, now we need to get to maintenance now? Still looking for the guides. This is locked. Oh! Voicemail. Hello, this is Bradley Voicemail System. This system connects to the microphone in your guide to let you leave messages for your fellow employees. These messages are stored to use for data collection to improve this service and for guide auto calendar functions. Find the lift? Yeah. Lift doesn't work. Well, it's the Bradwell Shuffle. One step forward, two steps back. Secured messages that only you can access for when you're too busy working to take a voice call. Okay. Uh, what's X? Oh, to leave? Okay. I need... That's one of two. Oh, this is the second one, okay. Uh, this is an auto-welcome response for HR. Congratulations for successfully completing your reduction. This is your first step into engaging yourself with the company. Oh, so this is the guy we, we took his ID. Right, 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 okay. After acclimatizing to your office, please go visit your assigned buddy, Mira Chandri. Your office will be unlocked to you, showing green markers, okay. Oh, did we just... Did we just get another blueprint out of that? I think we did. Maybe. On your computer, you have access to your company email voice. Uh, there should be a test substance substance blueprint attached to this email. Yeah, okay. That's what I got. Uh, wait. All right. Oh, there's a there's some more here as well. We reclaimed the rubbish bin. Not sure how that gonna help us, but oh, this now is open. Uh, okie dokie. Uh, let's go back downstairs, shall we? 
I'm sorry about my sniffling, by the way. It's just a, a, had a bit of a cold these past few days. I can't avoid it. All right, can we complete this test, please? Can I reclaim this? Okay. What else do we have here? Uh, nothing really helpful. Okay, so I'm not sure how I'm gonna solve this puzzle at the time being. Obviously, I need the. Uh, I need more parts of this pu puzzle. Okay, shall we try and head to maintenance now? No, it's still locked. How am I gonna get to maintenance? Your current guide won't let you in there. You've got to find a different guide that will let you through. Yeah, I know, but it's like... Uh, let's see if she knows anything about the puzzle. If she can help us out. Well, it's an office. Nothing more, nothing less. Okay. Don't forget to snoop around for a guide. Oh, could this be the reminder thing Rashmi referred to in her letter? Yes. Well, it's an office. Okay. Nothing more, nothing less. I got nothing. I got nothing either, lady. Uh, I don't know, man. Honestly, I'm stumped. Let's just make a whole like, circle, I guess. Does that help? Put this in the middle? Nope. Nah. They're missing a piece though. Oh wait, no we're not. Oh my god, I'm such an... An idiot! Wait. Oh, I don't know, I'm not... I, how I didn't see that earlier. Oh my god. What ding a bell. What a... Silly goose. Alright. Get this back. And we found the guide. Wait. Welcome back, Dr. Chowdhury. Your new Bradwell buddy, Dr. Alex Sager, is waiting for you in your office. Hey, I've managed to get into one of the power distribution control centers. It's not looking good. The facility generators aren't in great shape, so we need to find a way to get more power on the grid. Or we may be stuck here. Very dark uh, offices here. Can I go in here? No. Auto buy a reactor offline. Not sure if that's good. Okay, here we are at the labs. We just need to head down to maintenance over there. Okay. Oh, this place is open. Uh, not sure if I want to go there right away. Find alternative power for service lifts. Ooh, maybe we get that uh, photoreactor online. Could it be that simple? Let's try. Right, what's this here? Button? Press it. Did you push something? I just saw a panel light up. A photo bioreactor? So that's what they've been working on down here. I'll be honest, I don't really know much about photo bioreactors, only that algae and sunlight is involved. Thank God it's the longest day of the year. Oh, it's using hydrogen-powered fuel cells. Those things are powerful. Amazing, really, when... Uh-oh. Red pop-up boxes are never good. What the hell is happening? Are you okay? And now my screens have gone blank. Do you have any more details? Can you show me what's going on? Ugh, that's not good. Not just one, but three problems. Huh. I, I passed some CO2 extraction equipment earlier, so I'll go check it out. You, however, need to look into the algae pod and pump room situation. If we can fix these, I'm pretty sure I can bridge the fuel cells into the main grid and power those service elevators. Okay, right. We need to fix all of this, apparently. Not sure what's this big empty room here. Ooh, look at this. Um, can we open this? No. Can reclaim... Claim some of this, perhaps? What was it? Interacts. 
Right, it doesn't let me place anything on it. Alright, let's uh, pick up these uh, guides here. Happy birthday, Dr. Giller. Your colleagues have organized a surprise birthday party this afternoon. Please act surprised. Okay. Uh, what's this here? Algae for water purification. Uh, let's see what the tablet's saying. Voice message. Happy birthday, Ken. I uh, just wanted to give you a quick buzz. If we can have a meeting in the lab at, say, quarter to six. It's pretty important. It um, needs to be before Monday, though. Yes, I have a meeting on Monday morning, so um, I need to discuss this issue with you before then. Okay, that sounds like a birthday surprise to me. Uh, doctor, uh, dear Dr. Giller, we would like to extend our best wishes to you on your birthday. Know that we here at Bradwell R&D appreciate your important work. Enjoy this day and the many more you will spend with us. From Francis Kessler. Wanna grab a birthday brandy later? I don't know what you think you've heard, but if you think that anyone around here could be bothered to leave their computers long enough to put a party together, then you have a much better view of people than I do. I'll okay, I'm at the CO2 extraction system. Obviously, it's not I'll running. swing by your lab but just after six. Why? Because it does have power. Huh. Let me try to figure this out. All right, you do that, Amber. Uh, I've been stuck in this water initiative meeting all day. Not that you heard that from me, blah, 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 F, okay. Uh, what's this from Michael Boyd's water, wastewater pipe connection? Hi, those... I can. Those two pipes don't easily connect up. They'll need to shimmy some pipes around to leave the clear path. Then I should be able to attach it up... To attach it up some temp substance pipes. Which reminds me, I'm going to have to ask Clive for some substance allowance. Ugh, okay. And then we... S uh, is this our reply? Hi Mikey, we need those water pipes. No. Yeah, yeah. Uh, this is our reply. We need those waste, pi uh, waste pipes connected to the photobioreactor system. Do you need to get maintenance to do anything, or can you just... Can you get on that? Okay. Alright, we need to get this back on. So we need uh, to mess around with the algae pods and the pump pressure. Alright, let's see if I can find where these places could be at. Uh, this door is now open. Uh, okay. Who did that? Someone following me? Bioprocess engineering. Is this where they keep the algae? Uh, what's this? Green energy algae uses in energy production. This, ooh! Blueprint, nice. Five algae pot blueprints. Install three algae pots, okay. God, this is... Very greenish. Hydrogen is a natural clean burning fuel. When burnt with oxygen, the only emission is water vapor. Clean water and energy department. Private wiki. Figured out why the CO2 extraction system isn't running. Some filters need replacing and there are no spares around. I guess Oops. I better go and find some. Okay. Uh, context. Hydrogen has long been held as a possible successor to fossil fuels for the world's energy needs. It's only emission being water vapor when it is processed. However, hydrogen does not occur naturally on Earth in large quantities. Currently, current methods of producing hydrogen, such as electro electrolysis of water and steam methane reforming process, are energy intensive and lead to greenhouse gas emissions. Algae releases about 3 to 5% hydrogen during photosynthesis. By increasing these yields to a minimum of 50%, hydrogen becomes economically viable as a biofuel and the first renewable source of hydrogen gas on Earth. Using Bradwellium, copies and alterations can easily be made to the algae genetic code to increase the hydrogen yield. Hypothesis. By altering the genetic structure of an algae culture, the photosynthesis reaction of the algae will release higher high yields of I hydrogen. Found lots That's pretty cool. Lots of empty bottles. So if I can't get the CO2 apparatus to work, we can just collect our exhaled breath. Ugh. Might take some time. Two years, four months, 15 days, 21 hours, 8 minutes, and 5 seconds. Don't be cute. Okay, this is another terminal. Results from 3H27V and Narak blueprint. Hey Kenny, just so you are up to date, I ran the tests with the blah 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 blueprint which is the original approved uh, 3H27 algae culture, the NARAC. Here's a code module added RE Melissa's request. 
everything seems normal, but I need to get the wastewater pipe connected so I can run the stage 2 tests and check the purification efficiency with wa wastewater. The module addition doesn't seem to have changed anything, at least any against the things I am examining in my tests, so I guess that's good news. Mira. Uh, we also have from Clive Hanslow. Worried? I wouldn't say so. Just to be vigilant. Uh, should I be worried? Hey Ken, just a timely reminder since we have a big summer solstice event tonight. Melissa just wants all the wardens for each research sector to remind themselves of procedure in case of fire or other evacuation events. So please familiarize yourself with the safety protocols for your sector and proper evacuation procedure as stated in the Bradwell Emsbury R&D Health and Safety Manual. Uh, thought I located the CO2 extraction filters, but turns out it's just an upside down floor polishing machine. Who would do that? Alright, just let me know when you find them, please. Stop interrupting me. <laughs> uh, Melissa, yeah, okay, this is cool. We read this. From Mira, from Mira Chandri. Request updates to Blueprint from Melissa Bradwell. Yeah, I know you're right. Alright, let me see the original conversation. Where does this, this, this go like this? Yeah. Uh, hey Kenny, I've just got an email from Emily. Apparently Melissa or one of her people have asked for a code module to be added to the algae pod blueprint. Neither of us know what it's for and I'm concerned. Uh, I mean, there is lots of stuff going on in this building, so it could be combining research areas, but this is what happens when your research work is actually going to be used in the real world. It's not just yours anymore, and especially for something as big as the Clean Water Initiative. Melissa and the rest of the board will have their own agendas. Ultimately, the blueprint will function the same. Your work is still going to help thousands, if not millions of people around the world. So, is it worth getting into an altercation about? Uh, yeah, I know you're right. Clean water without chemical and also produce green energy while we are at it. We've done something I'm pretty sure have been impossible without substance. Just being part of the business system, I suppose, make baby steps towards the, that better world we are all aiming for. I'm not sure in which order do they go. Maybe like from top to bottom, I'm not sure. Uh, hello team, a quick update from everyone. This is from Francis Kessler. The Bradwell Summer Solstice celebration is happening on Sunday. Yes, Sunday is the longest day of the year, which is very helpful for us cave dwellers. In any case, the Bradwells are holding a fundraiser, fundraising event at the Stonehenge Museum topside. Part of Melissa's speech tonight will be about the algae water purification and green energy system, highlighting its dual use as clean water provider but also producer of hydrogen for energy use, in our system case, with fuel cells. This should be a big hit with governments and companies around the world and no doubt get people climbing over themselves to get these systems installed all over the globe. As, ev as everyone is aware, the main initial push with this phase of the clean water initiative is the urban water problem, so these systems have been targeted for use in the CT water systems. I know this isn't a move that everyone here is a fan of, but once we have shown the system's effectiveness in the cities, we will then have more scope for expansion into more rural areas. Good work everyone, Francis. It's pretty interesting. I'm not sure if this is... I, maybe it's based on uh, like real technology, but... Uh, extracting hydrogen from algae, that seems really, really cool. Okay, so this part is open now. I'm not sure if I should go to maintenance straight away. Uh, let me just... Go up here real quick. Can I enter? Any of these now? No, not really, okay. Uh... Fix problem in pump room 3. Okay. Wow, so many things to do now. Uh, how am I gonna fix this problem though? How am I going to fix this problem? Portable hydrogen fuel cell. Oh, that's pretty cool. Also, oh, they store the. all the cells in here, huh? Uh, let's store energy or hydrogen, whatever it is, in here. Okay! Alright. Alright, I guess I have to go through maintenance because it doesn't seem like I can do anything else around here. Alright. Uh, this is closed. Service lifts. Uh, pump rooms and water treatment. This is where I must find. Yeah, okay, cool. 
Good goal. Good, a good goal. Good goalie. I'm not sure what I'm saying. It's a big room full of uh, looks like pumps, of some kinds. Is it pumps or just those things? Ah, oh, it's closed. You have insufficient permissions to enter the water reclamation and clarifier control room. Oh well, guess we'll have to find you another way across. Oh, I have an idea. Oh, me too. I'm gonna try something. Okay. Is one of the clarifier walkways rotating? Yeah. Can you send me a photo? I need to know which one is moving. Oh, it's a clarifier. Okay. How would she know which one is nice. moving? This might actually work. You'll have to send me the numbers of the walkways you need me to rotate. It's a bit of a hack. Each walkway seems to have multiple stopping positions, so you might have to try a few times. This one. To help you cross the wastewater sea, I rotate for you, walkway three. <laughs> Thank you. Okay. Uh, Alright, can you rotate me again? Okay. Same one again. Yep. Alright, good job, sweet. Uh, now, where do I need to go, actually? Just across? Yeah, it seems just across. Yeah, six, please. My bag of tricks gets you number six. All right. Oh, Did you not rotate it again. Okay. Oh no. Oh, okay. Oops. Okay, same one again. Really? Is that was that clear? Didn't seem like it was, but okay. So they only rotate into a predetermined path. Here I comes guess. five. That's how we survive! And these weren't pumps, they were uh, clarifiers, apparently. I'm not sure what that means. It is. Maybe just a giant mixer or something? Alright. Will do. Rotate this one, please. One sec. Turning nine. Oh, not no. sure what to run. Uh oh. Something uh, just short circuited. Oh no. I, I I can't stop the walkway. You'll have to MacGyver your way through it. Alright, I'll do that. Uh how do I MacGyver my way through it though, to be honest? Let's see. Can I place something somewhere? Ooh. Ooh, maybe one of these. Is that solid enough? Oh that was so close, dude. Alright. Uh Maybe here. Uh, yeah. Okay, maybe a bit more. Like here. Uh, this seems like you would do the trick. Not really sure. Then we have to place another one there. Alright, perfect. Let's remove. Let me place this one. Like here. Perfect. Alright. This water is a bit murky. That's from all the algae. Who knows? Alright, let's take this. Uh, actually, I'll just leave that on. Oh, I heard that. I hope everything's still attached. Uh -oh. To you, I mean. No, I guess not. So, uh, this doesn't seem like it's rotating anymore, so I'm just gonna take this back. Alright, let's hit the pump room, shall we? Pump room three. Uh, what's all this? I'm ready to start pressing buttons. Alert pipe connection broken. Right, okay. Michael Boyd's tablets. Can't really interact with it. Oh, but he's here are his glasses. Welcome back, Mr. Boyd. Don't forget to attend Dr. Giller's birthday celebrations. Yeah, 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 yeah. Guide, note to self. In future, when maintenance say the water shuts off by itself, make sure that also includes that they will empty the rest of the water out of the system before I start working on it. I've managed to block the floor drain with some substance pipes, so the water isn't... draining. <laughs> oh god, that smells awful. I'm going to have to build myself a bridge out over the water like Emily suggested, and then unblock the... Stop recording. 
recording. Oh, did he cause the explosion or something? Uh oh. Maybe. All right. High priority. Got Let's... them. The CO two filters. Oh my god! All right. Uh, they're super heavy. Need to look for some wheels. Okay, go do that. Uh, Mikey, dear P brain, being late is unacceptable. Consider a black dot next to your name when it comes to your birthday. If in doubt, try and build over the water. That way you don't electrocute yourself into an early grave. Vite, vite. Emily, my petite... Uh, prep Suzette, I may be a little late. We are having some water issues at the moment. Nothing to worry about. Uh, nothing to worry anyone about, but I have to get rid of this before I gain trouble. P.S. I'm still annoyed I can't use the SMP in water. Then uh, from Michael Boyd to Emily Durant. Hey guys, or shall I say aloha. We're all set up for the party this evening from Kez, Ken's 55th birthday... 55th? 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 <laughs> Anyways. Uh, everyone's do done a great job of keeping this secret and hopefully you will be delighted with the surprise. So let's all meet in the race seating area at 6. Yes, I want you all having your desks on... Uh, leaving your desks on time. Surf's up or something like that, Emily. I found a shopping cart. Um, I found a shopping cart? Why would they have a... No overthinking, Amber. Eyes on the prize. Uh, this is from Clive Hanslow. Mikey, thanks for bringing the water reroute to my attention. The maintenance team have done the major work of rerouting the water around the pipes. You wanted to connect up. Wastewater comes in on the pipe at the top left and the pipe at the bottom right links to the water tank in photo by a reactor prep room. The water won't release until the pipe connection is sealed, so you can go ahead and link them up yourself. In accordance with the Bradwellium Conservative Protocol, be sure to use as few units of substance as possible for this mixture. The plumber said it should be able to do it with seven pipes. Uh, using more units than needed will be reflected in your employee review. Oh, thank you. Alright, so seven pipes we need to use to connect these two. Alright. Uh, wastewater pipe connection. Hey, Mikey, we need those water Waste, pi waste, waste pipes connected to the photo by a reactor system. Do you need to get maintenance to do anything, or can I get you? Okay. Okay, we actually read that email from the other sides, but. All right, cool. So we need to, we need to connect that to there. Apparently, I need to reclaim that one. Not sure. I'm gonna do that. Hold up. Warning. Moisture detected. SMP function offline. Oh, oh, yeah. About the SMP and water? Use of the SMP and water will result in burns, electric shocks, numbness, skin lesions, hyperactivity, and hair loss. They kind of don't like each other. Or they like each other too much. One of the two. Ah, oh, yuck. Ugh, what a mess. Sorry you have to fix those pipes. I'll keep an eye out for some soap and deodorant. Is this a pipe? Did I just start connecting this? Like, no one's business? Like, so how am I going to reclaim these... Oops. Remember, you can't use the SMP in the water. It's a safety thing. Not be used in the water, right. Okay, so how do I drain the water? Oh, God. Can I climb this? You're doing a great job, but I don't get this picture. Sorry. Yeah. All right. Oh my god, it's immediately back down here. What the frick? Just climb the ladder, dudes. There we go. Oh, come on. Am I stuck? Don't tell me I'm stuck, please. <laughs> oh my god. Game. Climb the fucking thing. Not sure what you're trying to frame here, but don't oh. let that discourage you. I think I'm stuck. Alright, I'm just gonna climb back down. And then try and climb up again. Alright, here we go. Nope. I'm stuck here forever. Anyways, this seems like a nice place to take a break. Uh, when we come back, we continue with more Bradwell... The Bradwell Conspiracy. This, if I can, because otherwise uh, that's it for the game. Thank you very much, and uh, see you all in the next one. Yeah, let's try and fix this. I'll see you soon. Bye-bye.